We're now at the point where there are just two weeks left in this presidential campaign. It's been a long and complicated road, to say the least. The question that now arises is how do these two candidates, Donald Trump and Hillary Clinton, want to close out this marathon? The first part of that question, I suppose, is do they want to be positive or negative in the stretch run? Does Donald Trump want to continue to say essentially the reason to vote for me is that Hillary Clinton is corrupt and she represents a failed establishment and that I am the person who's going to break down Washington as it is? Or does he want to create a more positive message? For him, I think the positive message would be to go back to the two themes that work best for him along the way. That is, I am a change agent. I will change the way things are done and I know how to handle the economy. That's been a little bit lost in the last few weeks amid all the controversies and the arguments, including in the debates. I think if he wants to have a positive message, it's those two words, change in the economy. Hillary Clinton has a similar choice. She spent a lot of time in the last few weeks explaining why Donald Trump is dangerous for the country. Her people say that she'd like to finish on a more positive note to give people a reason to vote for her, not just to vote against Donald Trump. If she wants to do that, I think that she will go back to the theme of the campaign, which is stronger together, which is a way of saying, I'm an inclusive person, not a divisive person, and go back to some traditional democratic economic ideas that the government will invest for you, reducing the cost of college education, creating infrastructure projects that create jobs, fixing Obamacare rather than throwing it out. Those, I think, are the traditional democratic economic ideas that she could go back to. As I said, though, there aren't a lot of things over the last couple of months that suggest we're about to embark on a positive rather than a negative road in this stretch run, but we'll know soon enough.